hey guys welcome back so today we're obviously going to be doing something to my hair as you can see it looks like it's already on my head because y'all are not going to guess what i got i got a 13 by 6 13 by 6 all the way to the back six inches hd lace frontal never thought i would see the day come again never thought all thanks to west kiss hair they're gonna be sponsoring today's video and they sent me this hair to review for you guys um i'm gonna give y'all i'm gonna tell you everything about this hair before we even get started look at this i swear to god this is not a bald spot my last wig was like this too i don't know what's going on like with my lace caps but it's making it look like it's a bald spot like you can even see there's hair right there so i don't know i don't know I didn't even pluck right there. I try not to pluck the middle anymore because I used to over pluck it a lot. I believe the density was is 180. Um, I did pluck it already. I'll tell y'all about that. And I tried, tried, tried to dye it because this hair would not dye. I probably should have got box dye. I was using, I went through two bottles of this trying to water dye and I don't know why this hair did not want to dye. Maybe I just wouldn't let it sit long enough we gonna put enough dye, but I know how to water dye, so I don't know what was going on. Or well, dip dye, whatever you call it. I had the hardest time plucking this wig, and I just ended up giving up because, I mean, you can see it still could use some more plucking, but I just ended up giving up. I tinted my lace with my Biani lace paint in hazelnut. I used to use Sienna, but I feel like Sienna was too cool tone for my skin, so I feel like hazelnut fits my skin a little bit better. Let me just show you guys what they sent me. First of all, this big old bonnet. Look at this big old bonnet. It's like a Valentine's bonnet. It's red or it's pink. My lighting is like horrible. Look at that. That's a huge bonnet. Like, and it's so cute. It's kind of tight, but it, it's going to stay on. Like, I've slept with it on and it stayed on. I like that. I need a good bonnet for wigs and stuff. I'm just saying this thing. I haven't opened it to see exactly what it is. So let's open it. It's a towel. Oh, no. It's a scarf. Oh my God. It's a scarf. It has a little crown on it. I, can, I, can I pull those off? I don't know. It has a crown on it, but I wouldn't do that. It's like really nice for when I tie my hair down for when I shower. Because it's like going to absorb the water, I feel like. Not this whole time, I thought I had two scarves. Y'all, this looks like a blanket. Oh my god, it's... <sighs> Y'all, look at how big the scarf is. This is, a, this is like a... <sighs> Anywho, I like that. So, let's go ahead and get started. I bought this ORS. I love it. Super wig super whole wig grip gel because i wanted to try this instead of glue but i don't think i'm gonna do that i'm gonna use glue because there's nothing like a glue glue melt so let's just go ahead and get started because i have a lot to do i am um, gonna speed through me gluing this down i'm not gonna talk throughout it you guys have seen me glue my wig multiple times hopefully if you're not new if you are new you're about to find out how I glue my wig down how far down do I want my wig to be mm. I might you know what I'm just gonna flip the whole thing back honestly and glue it I'm not even gonna try to do like a section I'm just gonna flip it back like this
guys i'm back um after it's literally been like probably maybe five days or more I promise i'm different i went through a little sickness so if my sound stopped up to this video i apologize but um my hair looks different it definitely looks different um i was not feeling the middle part so i switched it to a side part i actually took this off and reinstalled it and I went back in and dyed it because I could not, I just couldn't, I couldn't do the brown. I hate brown hair. So this has not been straightened or anything. I just put it on and um, did the part or whatever. So we have to figure out how am I gonna style this to make it look decent. So yesterday we went without power 14 hours cause we're currently going through a winter storm here and we're not used to stuff like this so we didn't have power for 14 hours in one degree i think it was one degree outside or seven but it felt like the negatives so that was horrible but today is a new day we have power and i'm happy so probably already know what i want to do to this i want to cut it i want to cut it because i don't like the length as a side part, I don't know. I want to go short, so I'm gonna cut it. Um, let me spit this gum out. So I'm gonna let you guys watch me cut it. Um, well, do you guys want me to? Do I need to say what I'm doing? I don't think it's very. I don't think I need to say what I'm doing. But this is how I cut my wig. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell, just tell you guys. I try to split it down the middle. Most of the time when I cut it like this, the back is always messed up. But it doesn't matter because who see the back? Only people in the back of me will see the back. So I don't really care about the back being messed up. So I'm probably gonna cut off about this much. See like whatever you I don't know. About let me see. Oh, that's kind of short. Oh gosh, okay, this is kind of scary. Okay, maybe I should cut it. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Okay. I'm gonna cut about this much. And it's too late to turn back now. These scissors suck. That's what I cut off. And as you can see, it is very uneven. So um, I'm not really too worried about the front because I am gonna be layering that a bit, but same thing on the other side. Is that even? No. Don't know. Oh my god, girl! I'm like not cutting this the right way. Oh my god. Okay. That's that's definitely not even. But I didn't want it like super long, so. Okay, yeah. And this is what it looks like in the back. I'm gonna show you. This is how it always comes out uneven. See? How uneven is that? Very uneven, okay. Um, I don't know if I'm explaining any of this right, but. I'm trying. Oh my God. Now I'm gonna do a couple of layers. Um, that's why I said I don't really care about the front being a little long because I'm gonna do a little bit of layers to it. And the way that I do my layers is I just go through and pick hair to cut. <laughs> this side definitely looks longer. So I'm just gonna go through and take my scissors and just like do a little bit of layering. Nothing crazy. I think I've shown how I do layers before actually.
okay guys so that's gonna be it um i did change shirts because i just want to film that shirt but um, can y'all see me but yeah that's gonna be it for this hair tutorial um i just want to show you guys how i was gonna style it like i, I had Okay. had to make this wig work i was having a little bit of trouble with it in the beginning but yeah i like it now uh it's really cute i love hair that's like short and curly this is really cute it's gonna be it for this video i hope you guys liked it um don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram if you don't already so yeah thank you guys so much for watching and bye see you guys later